Weapon parts, a med kit. We all leveled. Some scrap. Scrap weapon parts. Also keep in mind I blew all uh, oh. I blew all of my throwables pretty much. A Mimir needle pistol, two ammo, ten range. Ten percent crit for five damage. Short range pistol that shoots metal or glass needles. Hurts a lot up close. This was used during the attempted coup of Mimir 32, according to Chronicler Amadius. Sure. Give Bormir a silent weapon too, so we all can have a silent weapon. Stalker Vest, one health, two armor. Yoink! This is definitely worth it though, look at all the stuff. Okay, and leveling, I don't know if we can spend anything. Three points. Three points. Four points, you can get the health again. We'll save up with you, being able to fly. Allows you to get to higher places, which normally would be out of reach, and I think just naturally because you're flying, you'd have high ground advantage. That says it gives tactical advantage over the enemies beneath you, so if you were to have the uh, the top hat, that'd work really, really well, I think. Mm, eagle eye. Yeah, let's save up and get some of those with you. And probably also you. Yeah. Chem flare. Twenty-five percent aim bonus against lit enemies. When activated, the chemicals in this flare will bathe the surrounding area in a bright light, increasing the chance of hitting any target within its radius. Okay. There you go. Huh, that's funny. Saw a storybook in the Ark about the Ancients. They were wearing suits of armor just like this. Explorer Helm. Where is immune to critical hits? I mean, that's a no-brainer. <laughs> cool. Alpha level clearance only. Mimir emergency protocol 242 slash D15 EEP 242 D15. Article I in the event of a compromised government, key holders will be summoned to location Theta. Orders will then be issued depending on the level of emergency. Article 2 in the event of a hostile infringement by foreign or internal parties, key holders will be summoned to location Nova. Key holders must be accompanied by at least five plus enforcers. Extraction choppers are stationed in the following locations. And some random coordinates for you to plug into Google Maps and see where they go. <laughs> Hipster fruit tester. Uh, okay, power brick that has an image of fruit etched on one side and continuously displays a flashing power battery icon on the other. This was used to determine the ripeness of fruits. Chroniclers said that this device had a secondary music playing function which required some earpieces to be attached to it. Aha. Uh -huh. Very fancy. This looks like uh, a testing contraption for fruit. I heard stories about singing fruit that could make music. Is this somehow related? Why the hell would anybody need to test fruit? You either eat it or you slay it at some bozo's head. A bozo like you. 
I like the troll logic that they've got going on for all this stuff. Ugh. Is that just one dude walking around? I got this. Cover me. I think it might be. Easiest takedown Sorry ever. About that. Okay, back me up. Hey, level again. Does does Bormir not get levels? <sighs> or Borman, not Bormir. <laughs> ah. Maybe I have him try out his uh, silent submachine gun type thing. I wonder if you could like sneak around and use this as a vantage point for that fight. Although that other dude who was walking around, you could take him out. He was 10 health, but he'd be far enough away. I don't think his buddies would hear. Come on, scrap, scrap. I got a red thing on my radar over here. What is this? Does that actually tell me where enemies are? I'm not really sure. This, whoops, the vine stuff is, uh, all over the place there. Sorry, go back. And then I think after we explore this, I'm going to see if the fast travel to the Ark works and check out what the shops and stuff have, because I got, uh, I got some parts. Yeah, I'm not really seeing anything else here, so let's map hit h go back it just like fast travels us that's really handy i'm happy that you took on this mission to find hammond as you go deeper into the zone questions will arise in your heads you'll ask yourselves how this world became a wasteland I'll tell you. A long time ago, a strange disease sprang up in a city not too far from here. A vicious disease. The eyes of the victims would go red. They would bleed from their ears. Hence its infamous nom de plume. The Red Plague. Within 40 years, the plague destroyed most of the human race. A quick rake of death, scraping across the face of the planet. It was nature's revenge. Revenge against the greed, the arrogance, the egos of humans who thought they were gods. We call these fools the Ancients. We don't worship the Ancients like the madman in the zone do. Because our salvation doesn't depend on false gods who live in the heavens. It doesn't depend on the mirage of paradise beyond the zone. Our salvation depends on us. Us means humans and mutants together. And as two of our resident mutants, I bet you wonder who you are. <laughs> Where you come from, I wonder too. We all do. When I found you in the zone, you were shivering, naked, memories completely wiped. We took you in, taught you, and now you serve us as our hunters, our trackers, our warriors. We are indebted to you, stalkers. Never turn on each other. Hear me? Farewell. Remember your elder's guidance. 
the fix pet first, maybe. Heard you met some of them ghouls in the weird outfits out there. They call them shamans or something. Their screams alert nearby ghouls and sends them running straight for you. Next time you see a shaman, shut them up before all hell breaks loose. Yeah, and those were the ads that I th whipped a grenade at. So I can dismantle these, huh? We got some level two stingers, apparently. This one nobody's got on. Okay, yeah, you've got the the needle pistol and the gaper. That's fine. You've got the crossbow and a level two stinger. You've got the ancient pistol and a scatter gun. So this level two stinger we don't currently need. And I can dismantle it for 11 parts. Or something like the gaper. Yeah, it's currently equipped, so I can't even check. Okay. So maybe. Oh, a note, an EMP 30. One additional crit damage, 20% chance to disable robotic. Right. Maybe. Maybe. And yeah, I can just uh, right click to remove attachment. Okay, so what did your pistol have that was fancy? Just a nice scope. Right. Okay, let's remove that. Crossbow, remove that. Put on green eye. The chance to disable robotic enemies. That could be a really cool way to start a fight. Let's try it, maybe. Because burning them's good and fine, but uh, just not as powerful. It's only like one damage per turn, which, you know, it's something, but I don't know. And then that just improves the damage overall. Yeah, and the crossbow, I'm not sure. Take it easy. Because there's a different weapon being sold. Whoops, I don't want to go back to the zone. Damn it. At the shop. My favorite, the Molotov cocktail. Simple and effective. Light it. Throw it. Watch the world burn. What the hell's that gun up there? Can I get that? That's another ancient site. An EMP grenade. Pyro armor. Absorbs fire damage. Nice. Ancient eye for 10 crit chance. Mm. Couple of the chem flares. Man. Yeah, this thing though, the pipe gun. Five and six. Think I might. Yeah. Safe travels. Welcome to the fix pit. And we'll take stuff off the crossbow. Plus one fire to- oh. Well. <laughs> that, that's Molotovs, though. Mm. The... I have two of these to spend. Yeah, well, definitely that, sure. And then it starts costing two for these. Grenade damage plus four. <gasps> okay. Okay. Wish I could go with you, but I'm married to this bar. Okay. Can I eye from here? Yeah, okay, I can eye from here. Nice. So swap it for the pipe gun. Then we can disassemble the one of the stingers, unless we get a fourth person who for some reason needs one. I guess I'll hang Welcome on to it just to in case. Pit. My name's Delta. 
guess I could hang on to the crossbow then also, unless I really need the parts. Give it a nice scope. 18 range. I don't think that's counting his helmet that he's got on. And the damage module. And then we can upgrade it a bit. Uh... 30 and then it costs 60. I'm one short from upgrading it again. That's all right, though. And the Gaper, I'll upgrade also. Nice. Doesn't have um, attachment modules, but that's okay. It kind of comes with them by default. See ya. All right. So that's cool that you can just like quickly fast travel back here and uh, get stuff sorted real quick. I like that a lot. So I found some weapon parts a little bit ago that I had missed before, but uh, I'm just going to keep soldiering on and just save them up for later. And this is the ladder that I had uh, not gone up before, before I went that way, because they're like, oh, that's a well-hidden path or whatever. And this is roughly where I was also nearly spotted. Watch out for ghouls on the road. Some loot there, a dude on the bus, a dude near the loot, a dude by the yellow car, and a dude behind the red car. Hey, you on the truck! Ugly face! You see anything out there? No, there's nothing out there. It's Let's the zone. And stop calling me ugly face. Look at your face. I can't look at my face, it's my face. Now put your eyes out there and look for intruders. Yeah, I don't know if I can, uh... I don't know if I can really get through there, especially with that guy sitting there. Okay, so not that way. Some scrap. Otherwise, it's a dead end, it looks like. Nothing fancy. And another butcher with eight health. Gladiator armor, immune to crits, two armor and two health. Yoink! Wah! Whew. Oh, wow. That was close. And I can't take cover behind this rock, apparently. Okay, fine. There we go. Let's give the armor to you, because you've got some pretty... Cool ability, Stalker Vest. Oh, I had a spare Stalker Vest? I completely missed that. Okay, cool. So everybody's got a little bit of armor now. That's nice. And item-wise, we have nothing for you. Probably should have bought a grenade. Okay. Twenty-five percent crit chance. Twenty-five percent chance of taking him out stealthily. Otherwise, we have a lot of stuff to deal with. There's also a, uh, a robot there. Might be another med boat. And you look a bit like a shaman, so you can call ads. That's a problem. Let's, uh... Exit. Oh, I guess exiting ambush causes them to see you if you're in their circle then, huh? Because I don't think you would have seen me if uh, I didn't try to ambush. 
All right, well, I was gonna try to move everybody over to the left and try to take out the shaman before he can summon adds because while I can't one-shot him, I can probably still kill him before he does anything in his first turn. Well, uh, ducks, uh, do what you can, I guess. Who can't hit the butcher because he's on the other side of the tree. Because the cover system is really, actually, pretty awful in this. Does that hurt? I much prefer the XCOM 2 style of cover system, where you don't have to be exactly on a perpendicular flank with the dude, like these, these people here. You could be flanking them from this vehicle, or like here. It's good enough for a flank, you know, it's past that 45 degree threshold. But in this game, you have to be past this. So here wouldn't be a flank. You'd have to be like down here, which just generally puts you in a really bad spot overall because the uh, just the position of cover isn't very good. And I think I ignore you guys for now. We'll activate you later, I guess. Yeah, slap him. Everybody moves in overwatch. Oh boy. Okay, I guess we'll activate you both. Ducks. Finish him off. Great work. Yeah, can't really hit a lot of people here. But you can Root a bunch of them. And with the silence pistol, you can hit a lot more. Yeah. So let's go for the hunter, the guaranteed damage. You can't knock them back. I was I was hoping that wouldn't cancel the roots because of the knockback. <laughs> Thankfully, it holds them. So a lot of these guys, they can't move, so they're forced to either overwatch or take a shot at people who are a bit far away and behind cover, so... Damage should be generally... pretty mitigated. Except for ducks. Poor ducks. Yeah, you're just gonna keep picking on me. That's fine. So ducks. Sprint to there. It's only half cover, but oh well. All these guys can move this next turn, I think. Or is it their current turn? I don't know. He's out of here. One of ours is down. You're earning your scrap, kid. Okay, so ducks can help out.
The med bot, I think I'll just ignore. Surprisingly, you can't hit. All right, yeah, because you're not actually flanking him because of how the cover system works. It's so stupid. Um. It's so stupid. This is a flank. Like this is this is a flank. Um. Mm. So point blank shotgun, the shaman moved. Yeah, and then Borman can work on the Marauder, I guess. Or just shoot the butcher that's also next to you. Yeah, let's just do that. And then you can shoot. You can't hit that guy? And then you're worried about flank from the med bot. The, the med bot's a, it's a melee, so just, just go for it. Okay, now you can hit the Marauder. Now you can hit the Marauder, okay. So we'll do that, and Borman can finish off. Ugh, okay, fine. So ducks will finish off this butcher. They took one of ours out. You ain't half bad for a newbie. And yeah, I think just shoot him. Feel that? Okay. They really don't like her. Shaman on the high ground. I wonder if he can summon more adds. Long range pipe gun. Only a 50%, but that's not bad actually. I'm surprised. You can't hit him, he's impossible to hurt. Medbot's still working over there, fine. Whoops. So Selma. Can't see shit. Could do that, and Borman could, uh... Can't see the shaman. Hmm. 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 Well, let's do. Let's do that. Because I'm happy with your spot and you can hit him and cool and awesome and yeah. Now, the question is what to do with you two. And I'm tempted a bit to pull back and see if I can get them to come a bit closer. Move a longer distance at high speed. What? No, that, that's sprint. Okay, I was gonna say that's not what tree hugger does. <laughs> but uh, we could just like pull back tree hug when they uh, advance a bit, because the only person they can see right now is ducks. So they're gonna be taking a shot at ducks. Maybe Borman. But if he comes here. Out of range. All right. So reload that. You need to reload too? Yeah, you do. And you can just overwatch in case they move. She is, but your position doesn't let you see him. 
But he did move a, quite a lot closer. Reapplying facial mass. Have a super day. Hunter's going for a flank. Overwatch. Do it now! Kill it! Getcha! There's the Overwatch. Damn. That would've been great if you hit him and killed him right away again. Okay. Ugh. Damn it. I'll do that though. Pin the med bot, keep him over there. Pin the hunter because he's going for a flank and I can't deal with him right now. Ducks, you got a butcher on your ass, but what else can you hit? You can kind of help out with the shaman with just the pipe gun. Okay, who's overwatching? One marauder with a handgun. And you can get to some funky positions with your sprint because of your talent. I don't know how useful that'll be. I figure, again, it's going to be one of those things where when I need it, I need it. That's flanking. You can still see him here, huh? Okay. No line of fire anywhere that could work. So you could run and gun, get there. And shotgun him. Potentially knocking him off the high ground. That could be interesting. Let's try it. Because you can't... Yeah, you can't get up there. There's that. Yeah. Nice. That's fucking cool. I like that. And now I could have rutsed. Ah, well. But now you are okay to... He's not rutsed. You guys are. You've currently got a flank on Selma. So if I go here, that Marauder could still flank you pretty easily. If I go here, pretty good chance of hitting the Shaman. Okay, let's try that. Finish out the Shaman. Oh, fuck, he'd already moved this turn. Okay, well. Um, damn it. Yeah, I forgot you rutsed. Die. Yeah, kill the shaman while we can. The marauder can probably chop you now, but oh well. You're stuck, you're overwatching, marauder will move. Going back up to the high ground, Borman will help out with that. Oh, okay. So switch to the pistol. Shoot him in the face. Handled. Borman needs to reload. Would like to be able to see if I can even shoot the dude if I had ammo. Yeah, I would. Okay. So it should be okay to reload and shoot him then. Yeah. Seven damage knocked him out of cover, and Sama can maybe finish him off. The Hunter, I believe, can move this next turn also. Should be noted. So you can, but your chance of hit's not so good. It's a bit better if we step here, but then you only have the half body cover instead of the full body cover. But you got enough armor and stuff. Uh, 
Oh, right, yeah, we killed a couple of people. Oh, hell yeah, you stay there. for the shot. Nice. So now the med bot. You're stuck, but yeah, your roots didn't refresh. Damn, now I know. Overwatching. That's, that's fine. Yeah, he can't see you. Blast the robot. Ah, damn. We'll just harass the robot for a while. And Selma will absorb the reaction shot. Yeah, broke all the cover there. Damn it. 